Mini PCs are getting traction lately ever since Apple released their awesome M1 Apple Mac Mini. Not only is this true for consumers, it seems to be becoming popular among companies. Asus has already had a foothold into this market ever since 2013 and fast forward 11 years later, they are still going strong with their latest NUC 14 Pro Plus. I have very little expectation starting this entire review process thinking that nothing can beat Apple's M1 Mac Mini but the more I use the NUC 14 Pro Plus, the more I found out that this is one piece of a machine. The first thing that caught my eyes were the multiple last gen and current gen IOs that are literally all around the unit. On the front, you can find one USB-C 3.2 and two USB-A 3.2. At the back, you can find more ports, Thunderbolt 4, one USB-A 3.2, USB 2.0, which is a last-gen technology, two HDMI 2.1, one LAN port, and one for the DC power connector. And of course, you can find the Kensington lock there as well. On the sides, you can find three heat sinks that will help you with all of the overheating management. This is awesome and will help with any thermal throttling. That can happen during heavy resource utilization on the NUC 14 Pro Plus. The little start at its bottom part elevates the body slightly to make the entire airflow underneath even better. What I like is that the heat sinks blends well with its aluminium ionized body. It just makes the entire look very, very premium. You can also choose to mount this on any VESA mounting plates, should you choose to. And now let's move on to the more exciting features of the NUC 14 Pro Plus has to offer. Number one would be the display that it can output to. If you think this device outputs to just two displays because it has two HDMI ports out, you cannot be more wrong because of its other two Thunderbolt ports, which means it can display out to a total of four external displays. Yes, not one, not two, not three, but four. So if you are someone who has multiple monitors already set up at your work desk, this is definitely something up your alley. Unfortunately, I do not have many external displays over here, not many monitors, I just have that one. So I cannot show you this entire spectacle of hooking up to four external displays. Number two is the AI engine that is equipped with the device. The AI is supposed to make up for any RAM speed or heavy graphics requirements that the device lacked. So to prove this point, I decided to do something crazy, which is to download a game called Hell Divers 2. Now, for the non-gamers out there, Hell Divers 2 is one of the latest games that has come to the PC. Of course, it was a PlayStation exclusive but it is a very graphics intensive game. The entire game took only eight minutes to download on a one gigabit broadband network. I was very surprised that the NUC 14 Pro could run this game. Well, not at the highest setting because at the highest setting, I could only get about 20 FPS, but when I put the settings to the lowest, I could get between 40 to 50 FPS. And I could play Helldivers 2 on this machine. That is just nuts. I wish I could show you more content such as video rendering on this machine or using the different AI platforms like your cloud, like your co-pilot, like your chat GPT, all the image generation, mid journey, so on and so forth. But unfortunately, my camera battery died when I was filming all of those things. So all of it was lost. And all in all, I think this is a very powerhouse of a machine. The number of IOs alone is enough to make anyone or any geek geek out. And let's not forget that this unit can connect to four external displays simultaneously. That's just nuts. And the icing on the cake is of course that you can run games on this PC, even graphic intensive ones, although not cranking the graphics all the way to the highest or ultra settings, but definitely can run on the lowest one. All right, guys, that's it for the video. If you do enjoy it, hit the like button. And if you are new to the channel, consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification button 
to be notified whenever I upload new videos. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.